All right, so the assignments in this module, uh, they should be fairly straightforward. They're just an introductory uh, to English A31, just to kind of get your brain working and thinking about English topics and setting some goals for yourself and kind of letting me know a little bit more about yourself. So for this assignment, it wants you to tell me about yourself. So for many of you, this is probably challenging. You often don't like to brag about yourself or talk about yourself or even have to think of things that represent you or things that you like doing, but that's what I need you to do here. So it says, to start, please write down 10 things about yourself so that we can better get to know you. I would like these in full sentences, so just do your very best. For example, you could put, I like to swim. I like to read in my full time. I am a grade 12 student looking to go off to post-secondary education afterward. Something like that. Tell me anything you want. You do need to write 10 things. Then the next question. Again, I would like these in full sentences with proper grammar, punctuation, the best that you can. So do your very best. Describe your personality in a minimum of five sentences. So try to think of even five personality traits, if you could. Uh, are you outgoing? Are you kind? Are you caring? Are you very shy? Are you introverted? Are you extroverted? Tell me anything you want about your personality so I can get to know you a little bit better. Then the next question, I want to know what are some things you like to do in your free time and explain those things. Number three, what are some hobbies or pastimes you enjoy? So when you're not at school or when you're not working, what are some things you like to do in your downtime, in your free time? Do you like to read books? Do you like to watch movies? Do you like to play video games? Do you like to maybe go to the gym and work out? Do you like to go shopping? Number four, who would you say is your biggest role model? So a role model, this is number four here. A role model is someone who possibly you look up to, someone who maybe you admire. Or, like I said here, if you don't actually have a role model, you can put who do you, uh, you can comment on who do you look up to. So often a role model might be um, a famous figure. I know a lot of people, especially basketball fans, looked up, look up to Kobe Bryant or Michael Jordan. Uh, a lot of young hockey players look up to hockey superstars. A lot of young aspiring singers look up to singers that have become very famous over the years. So do you have a role model? Maybe a role model is someone as simple as a mom or dad or an aunt or uncle or an older brother or sister or a friend. Just comment on someone that you look up to and I want you to tell me why you look up to them. Uh, number five, this is quite a personal question. I want you to tell me about your experience in elementary school and high school. What are some things you liked or maybe perhaps did not like? So tell me maybe where you went to elementary school. If you went here in Regina, you could name the school. Uh, if you went to school uh, for grades kindergarten to grade eight in a different country, you could comment on that. And then at high school. So for some of you, you maybe have been out of high school for several years and that's absolutely fine. This is why we are back here at adult campus to get our grade 12. But do tell me what high school you went to or your experiences in high school. Number six, this is an important one. What do you plan to do after you are done at adult campus? Do you have any future job aspirations? So perhaps you are already working a part-time or a full-time job right now, or maybe even more than one job. So is this a job that you want to keep into your future, or is this a job that you are just working at right now? What is your future job aspirations or goals? So after achieving your grade 12, what is your plan? Do you plan to go off to post-secondary, some kind of college or trade school or university? And what job would you eventually like to do for the rest of your career? Or are there many things you think you might wanna do? Or perhaps since you are so young right now, maybe you have no idea and you just wanna try a few things out or even take a break from school for a bit after you get your grade 12 and work and try different jobs to see maybe what interests you. All of that is fine. I just want you to comment 
um, on this question and tell me what are your, your goals after this.